Kia ora, ko Manik Bradley tōku ingoa, he kai kōrero aho. I am a storyteller. I thought today, because I've been encouraging so many of our workshop participants to share the stories behind why they do what they do, I thought I'd better do it too. So I thought I'd share with you today one of the stories behind how I got into TV shopping and how I got into the industry that I'm in, which is as a storyteller. So my earliest memory of thinking or believing that I was a TV presenter and, and in particular a, a product demonstrator and TV shopping presenter was actually when I was six years old. And I used to stand in the kitchen making scones and I loved it. My mum is a, a cooking and sewing teacher so I was always doing lots of creative work. So I would stand in the kitchen and I'd make these scones, always cheese scones too because they're my favourite. And in front of me was the kitchen window. And I used to particularly love doing this at night because it would be dark outside so that I could actually see my reflection and it was like watching myself on a big screen. And I have such incredible memories of making these cheese scones and talking into the lens of the camera like I was talking to my best friend. And that's how I always felt about being on camera and, and being able to demonstrate products and talk through the process of creating scones or making scones. Jump forward 30 years later and I was the MC of the food show which uh, I used to travel all around New Zealand, Auckland, Wellington and Christchurch and this is a true story by the way and I found out a few days in advance that one of the speakers that I would, I would have to introduce on the stage was Alison Holst. <laughs> well this was like all of my timelines merging into one and this was a dream come true for me because I idolized her on television and because she had this incredible voice that to me sounded like chocolate and joy and love all mixed in together. So the day arrived and here I was about to meet Alison Holst, my idol. And I walked in and it was like all of the angels went ah all at the same time and here she was right in front of me. And of course my job as the MC is to go and make a connection with every single one of the presenters, ask them what they need, how they would like me to facilitate their session with the audience and check on the introduction. <laughs> but this was the first time in my life meeting an actual idol and I'm not too proud to admit that I fangirled and I fangirled hard <laughs> and I walked up to her and I said Kia ora Alison, my name is Monique, I'm the MC today and when I was six years old I used to pretend to be you and I love you and then I curtsied. Yes that actually happened. <laughs> so she turned to me and she said oh Monique in her beautiful chocolatey velvety voice oh Monique that is the loveliest thing anybody has ever said to me. And in that one moment, I just realized that not only was my assumption of Alison uh, correct, but it was demonstrated to me just how warm and wonderful she is. She is, it was as a human on camera and off camera as well. So that's my connection to why I do what I do, why stories are important, Sharing that one story with Alison created an instant connection with her and I have so much respect for everything that she's done in her career. So if you want to look at a different way to create a meaningful connection, I hope through this video you've got a bit more of a connection to what I do and why it's important. Reach out, come and try one of our storytelling workshops or reach out and start coaching. Stories are an incredible way for us to take our ideal client on a journey and to exchange information that statistics have shown us is remembered 70% better than information alone. So if you're ready to become a better storyteller, if you're ready to show your authentic self to the world, get in touch. Click the link below or beside or above this video on whatever platform you're watching it on and let's connect. Let's tell more stories. Engari. Komenek Bradley Toku Ingawa He Kai Kōrero Aho. I am a storyteller, and so are you. See you next time.